Hello, Sun Exchangers. Welcome to this, the 51st episode of Sun X Video Diaries. It's springtime here in South Africa, so we're really feeling the energy from those early signs of summer. There's lots going on behind the scenes and in the world around us, which affects all things solar energy. So this is the episode to catch up on all things Sun Exchange. This month, we're seeing COP26 being held in Scotland. So fighting the climate change emergency truly is now at the top of the global agenda. But whilst big businesses and governments are discussing their plans on how to address the threat of climate change, you, the Sun Exchange community and the Sun Exchange team are already taking action on the ground and making that transition to clean energy happen. The Sun Exchange platform enables all individuals anywhere in the world to generate clean energy at the click of a button. Since the last episode of SunX Video Diaries, you, the community, have made two major solar projects happen. One for Rob Ferreira High School and one for Outer West Recycling Plant. Outer West Recycling Plant is the first project of its kind done through Sun Exchange. They keep 200 tonnes of plastics from entering our environment every month. So that's a huge positive impact and you have just reduced their operating costs. So congratulations to everyone that made that project happen. We've also seen two new solar projects go live and start producing power through this platform over the last quarter. Both Rondebosch Boys High School and Spa Lulikani are now seeing lower cost energy thanks to all the solar cell owners now producing power for those projects. So congratulations and thank you to everyone who are now earning solar powered money whilst reducing the cost of education in South Africa. Some other big news for Sun Exchange. Arch Emerging Market Partners, one of our investors, has just doubled down on their investment in this company to enable us to continue the growth and the scale in which we operate across the African continent. Bill Barry, the Managing Director of Arch, has commended us for our growth as a fast emerging leader, eliminating obstacles to solar power across Africa and has reaffirmed their continued support for us. As Sun Exchange projects expand into the rest of Sub-Saharan Africa, we'll be addressing issues such as food security and energy reliability, two fundamental things which enable sustainable development across the continent. If you visited your Sun Exchange dashboard recently, you would have noticed a few small tweaks to your Sun Exchange experience. Most notably, you will now see a currency conversion tool when you're ordering your solar cells, which allows you to see the value of the solar cell purchase and also the earnings in the home currency of your choice. You will now see on your, also on your dashboard a currency conversion showing you the value of the earnings in your Zar wallet. So thank you all very much for watching this Sun Exchange video diary episode. Please do like and share this episode on your social media and spread the news of Sun Exchange and how people can start taking climate action immediately and earning income from providing solar energy to worthwhile organizations. Thank you all very much and I'll see you all next time.